know the program, I know the departments, a BA general in Bengali, BA general in Sanskrit, BA general in Fall Science, BA general in English, BA general in History, BA general in Philosophy, BA general in Education, BA general in Physical Education, BA honors in Bengali, BA honors in Sanskrit, BA honors in Fall Science, BA honors in Philosophy, BA honors in English, and BA honors in History. We have 8 departments and 14 programs. Uh, this is the organogram of our college, the, the apex, uh, the uh, head of the uh, college, which is the governing body, the apex body, and the policy making body, and the governing body, the principal, and also in the absence of principal, the uh, administration is on vice principal. So, under principal and vice principal, all staff, then uh, taking all staff, so we have different committees and sales, and we have divided all those committees into three parts, then there are two parts, the academic and administrative and both are coordinated by IQAC and the I Academy Committee is divided in three parts, curricular extension and co-curricular, co-curricular, administrative uh, committee, the finance committee, purchase and care committee, development committee, etc. <coughs> uh, we have also uh, some other committees like uh, <coughs> environmental conservation, conservation, uh, conservation action committee, coordination with the local community, college ethics committee, students welfare subcommittee, career council itself and women cell that is ICC internal conference committee. And we have also academic subcommittee, equal opposite cell, and also grievance leaders as uh, This is the guiding factor. We need some of the factors to guide us. That is our vision, motto, and mission. Uh, our vision is to develop an original student who should be able to have evidence to follow and criticize argument for his own value on authorities. Our motto. So I have not come over here in the field from Pahitiri Upanishad, strive constantly towards true learning and progress, where there is education, there is progress and upliftment. It is the power of progress and upliftment. Our mission it is taken from the writings of the Dr. B. R. Ambedkar, the five books, the college has been named. We will forego material benefits where we can forego our rights and opportunity to reap the benefits of higher education to the fullest extent as education is the greatest material benefits. Our objectives, uh, to introduce effective and efficient teaching and learning practices, to provide a platform to students for learning through latest resources, to develop students intellectually, moral information building, to develop students to become perfect human beings. Uh, our human resources principal at the, uh, the uh, professor post in the West Bengal principal post, the professor post, so we have do not have an associate professor and uh, one other associate professor post is due from the Vice principal, but the promotion is due. The associate professor is here. No, 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 it's here. It is here. No direct appointment. No direct appointment. In this structure of the college service commission, there is no direct appointment of associate professor. There is through cash. Uh, Dr. Rupi Namani, your vice principal, I have paid it at once to the post of assistant for the due. Due to the pandemic, it is a pen. We will do it at the end of this. The assistant professor, we have uh, actually we have 11 Samsung posts and in IMP. Uh, from uh, assistant professor, we have uh, uh, faculties having PhD, uh, three faculties having PhD and the four faculties having MP. Uh, there is a one uh, post created by the government of Western, that is state aided college teachers. Uh, they are 15 in num 15 number, that is SAC 1 and SAC 2. One means those who have PhD or made set, etc. They are bracketed uh, in SAC 1 and they are in SAC 2. We have 13 in SAC 2, as, uh, 13 in SAC 2 and 2 in SAC 1. So what is the pattern difference between SAC 1 and SAC 2? SAC 2, those who have PhD doctorate degree, or uh, uh, late set qualification, they are uh, placed in SAC 1. Uh, those who are only the master degree criteria, the 55% eligibility criteria, they are placed in SAC 2. What is the salary difference? Uh, the, it is 10,000 dollars. 10,000 dollars. For SAC 1, what is the category? What is that? Salary. Uh, they are growing very now. Uh, basic, uh, the starting salary is 35,000. And I am going to increase 3% of the year. 25 percent. 25 percent. But as I said, one thing I will want to correct it. Those of 10 years experience, they get 35,000. But those below 10 years, they get 31,000. And those who are sad, those who are under place in sad 2, those who have more than 10 years experience, they get 25,000 plus. But those who are below 10 years, they get 25,000 plus. 
Now we have non-T6 now, full time non-T6 6, we have no proof, we don't have head clerk uh, post, it is not, uh, it is not created yet, we have one accountant, uh, group C post 2, C group, group D post, and uh, but our management has taken care of this and uh, appointed some post staff to run the day to the college and affairs. Uh, we have one contractual librarian that is appointed by the management, contractual guest faculty, we have five guest faculties, those who uh, those are appointed by the management. We have contractual non physics staff, seven contractual non physics staff. So we have housekeeping staff. How do you manage payment? Payment from the college fund. Uh, we have uh, housekeeping, one sweeper and one cleaner. They are, they are also paid from the college funds. The gender ratio, teachers for full time teacher ratio, uh, if you take uh, the, uh, out of 10, uh, 6 are female and 4 are female, 6 are female, 4 are male. If you take the uh, sex into the consideration, that is it. Teaching faculty male 16, female 13. If you take the consider of the whole staff of the college, the male 13 to female 14. This is the status of highest degrees achieved by our faculty. The assistant professor completed PhD 3, or PhD pursuing 4, MPhil completed 4. SAC 1, PhD completed 1, and MPhil completed 1. SAC 2, or PhD pursuing 3, and MPhil completed 2. Uh, Institute of Efforts in Human Resource Development, we have an appointment as assistant professor during this uh, last five years. This is assistant year, five years. Five assistant professors, uh, four assistant professors are appointed, uh, no SACs. Management appointed contract and non-teaching staff, four appointed. Management appointed contract and guest faculty, seven appointments. And this is the promotion status. Uh, SACs are promoted. They, before this, they were uh, designated as part-time teacher. Now they are called as state, state aided college teacher. And uh, three assistant professors, professors are promoted under CAS. Uh, four guest faculty are designated as, uh, they are also uh, taken by government of West Bureau, that is SACs. Right. Before that, they were uh, guest faculty of this college. Uh, this is the faculty development, development program to, uh, since 2016 to 21. Uh, we have RC, 7 teachers have completed their refresher courses, 10 teachers have completed their uh, orientation programs, 4 teachers uh, have uh, participated uh, the programs, faculty development pro programs conducted by the institution, and 7 teachers attended the workshops conducted by the affiliate university, that is the West Bengal State University. Uh, we have signed two modes with the one college and one uh, the, 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 uh, IT sector. In the college portal for sharing the virtual platform for two subjects or three subjects because we don't have sufficient faculty in these three subjects that is education, physical education and English. Uh, we have uh, the move with the PMS College Portal, the, the college situated in this district, 24 governors, not 24 governors, and we have also another move with my point subsolution private window for skill courses. Yes, we have intake and enrollment. Uh, uh, there is a big gap between India and India. This is, that is due to uh, the non-filling of the honor seats. Uh, we have uh, six subjects having honor courses, but uh, now it is after the uh, discontinuous of school service commission exam in West Bengal, many students are not willing to take honor subject, and uh, also there is a post culture under CBCS. They are taking it very difficult to take honor courses, and they are also there is a social condition is in this locality. Uh, so they think they are not taking honors courses, they are studying. You are in 1854, sir. 1854, sir. Yes. What is the actual only one of them? And uh, last year we have, uh, there is 1078. 1078. Yeah. So why do you not reduce? Yeah, yeah, sir. There is a, uh, in the principal the demand ratio. Yeah, there, 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 there is a very low. Very soon, that because in, in our uh, meeting of the principals of this uh, of the West Bengal, it was proposed to reduce the intake capacity of honors courses. But they told us that you should, uh, from the college side, you should not do that because they they they, they have a message to the society that college is uh, uh, contracting the government. That is, uh, you may minimizing the scope for this education. So you don't do that. You know, we are collectively uh, approach the government to minimize the to last down the uh, if the university takes on its own to start down the street, then it will be okay, but college should not take on its own, then it will uh, have a negative uh, basis to the society.
college in the of explanation of education, it is for negative science. Actually, we uh, have this subject, six subjects in Sanskrit, we have 131 seats for only three or four subjects students are taking Sanskrit honors. In uh, political science, we have 50 seats and two, two or four students are taking political science honors. The seats are there, but for past course of students, students are be getting filled in day by day. Uh, but still, we are uh, day by day are increasing our uh, seats in 2016 17. It was 1169 our intake capacity, at that time it was 6 for 7 was filled in. Uh, next year it was uh, something down, somewhere from a half year down. Next year from 1718, it was continuously on increasing mode. <coughs> Student teacher ratio, uh, very unfortunate. We have to, uh, last, uh, the last assessment year, that is 2021, we have 2205 students and teachers were 26. So, 84.8 is a friend. What is the total students? First, all students. All students. Teachers, it is 84, 1 is 84. Yeah. So, why are you not demanding? We have many, many of times we have submitted our proposal for the creation of the course, for the filling of the course, but we are not getting it. Because you see, criteria is 1 is 30. Yeah. The government of Western has notified that in normal subject there is a minimum of 4 teachers are needed there. But we have only one teacher, in history we have one teacher, in political we have two teachers. We are not getting 5 teachers. Anyhow we are not getting 5 teachers. In college in general we have 5 teachers. 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 Student, 
may say it has to be rupees, but we don't collect it separately. How many fees collected from the students? We provide 14 fees per student to these students. And also from the persons who have the capacity to pay for the institution, or we have also collection from these funds. Another fund that uh, created last year, the uh, Alfonso Fund, American Lance Fox Fund for Original Institutions of Hours. It is the, the, the we, this fund is generally not from the college. Our uh, staff has a stability fund, the, the fund is there in the village. Uh, uh, there is a fund, uh, we have uh, the dividend and the profit. Uh, from the profit, 2% of the profit we provide to this fund. Stability fund is covered as well. Actually, it's like this. To the power of the public benefit from the revenue we are, to the public provide to this fund and the students, uh, those who are needy, we provide them much for uh, working us from our college campaign. Also, there is a benefit fund. Uh, How many do you adopt it? Five minutes. Five minutes. The 15 curriculum implementation is we have a plan, a teaching plan, properly prepare academic calendar also, we have also the activities calendar, then we go for implementation, that is a departmental meeting, department committees are there, they prepare routine, they also prepare our syllabus also, and then uh, uh, they also uh, have uh, uh, work note distribution. Then class test and unit test, the assessment also taken and the correct measures from the result. But after the public result of each semester, or the exam subcommittee sit and they have a review on this and they will collect the feedback accordingly, we uh, proceed further. Result analysis, uh, uh, this is uh, in 2017. Uh, what percentage? Actually, we have uh, near about 70% so total. Average. Average. Average is ACSR, sir. Mm. It is automatic, calculated automatically there. What is the number? Yeah. Appeared and passed. Oh. Number of students appeared in 2007 to 38 and number of students passed oh. 152. So, in 2021, it is 100%? 100%, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is every year, yes, sir. Quantitative data in the? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Student progression, actually we don't have the uh, mechanism, we do not have the mechanism to collect the data how, where the students are going after the uh, composition of the degrees. Uh, since my joining, I have tried my best to collect the data where the students are coming to the uh, campus for any purpose. We take the data from them where they, how, what they are doing now. And according to their collection, we have now, uh, so far we have collected 61 students have placements in different sectors of the uh, government job. And also 57 students have moved to the higher division, that is master degree or uh, BA, MA, etc. Uh, teaching learning mode, we have planning, uh, how, what is the planning, how we plan uh, our teaching plan, that is the work or distribution through departmental committees, then time table preparation. Then we have the academic planning. Yes, we have also academic calendar, preparation of study materials. Then implementation mode, blended teaching mode learning. We have both online and offline mode. We have interdisciplinary activities for teachers from one faculty, one department also provide lecture to the students of other departments. We have ICT and online teaching. We have also participatory learning systems. We have the projects. We have video lecture through it. Then there is a discuss to just a few minutes back. Uh, assessment, we have continuous assessment uh, under the CBCS mode. We have also internal assessment before the CBCS mode. We have the test exam, that is seasonal assessments. We have also seminars and project evaluation, that is skill based courses, that is taken in skill based courses. And also at the end of the semester, we have university exams. We have review, uh, then we have periodical, periodic academy review for academy search committee meeting and exam held these meetings for review of the result and the grievance of the students. Next the exam pattern and uh, the, how we take the exams. We, uh, the exams are taken at two levels, the institution level and the university level. At the institution, the institution level, we have the continuous into the internal evaluation, the continuous assessment, the through internal assessment. Then the assessment, the, uh, the assessment procedure is uh, assessment through integrity exam, through participatory learning, through fiber, and also we have taken out, we also 
introduce higher taste to the bigger screen, how they speak, how what is their speaking capacity, we also taste that, and also there is a mark, a certain mark, high marks uh, for attendance, for uh, in, attend, uh, presenting the class. Then at the end of the semester, there is the university exam, where they, the marks are uploaded in the exam portal, then they get the promises. Uh, category 2 lead to the different level, there is the younger students, we have RAM, we have the wheels here, we have special toilets. How many students do we have? Actually, we have three or two or three students. Yeah. Uh, we have special toilets. We have different different students are allowed to take the service of scribes with the permission from the university. And also, we have collected some parches and brain books in our public library, in our central library. It's an effort to integrate for cross cutting issues. Then we have different subjects. We have an internal content committee, we have anti ragging set, we have college ethics committee, we have environment and conservation action committee. That is our innovative idea. We also have our best practices and also we have the other committee set. Skill courses, the subject of which has skill courses, which has provided skill courses, they are mainly the owners and general, both owners and others. Yes, yes, yes. And apart from university guidance, we will provide yoga and guidance. The latter it was included in the university syllabus. First of all, it was introduced for our college, for female students guidance and yoga for our students. And then we have last year we have introduced the basic community English because students of this level are poor in English, so we have introduced the basic community English as add on course. Uh, student participation in uh, council, then we get the representation in GB from students council, we get the representation in students welfare subcommittee, we get the representation in student admission subcommittee, and also we have the representatives from students uh, community in IEQAC. Participating management, uh, both uh, all teaching, non-teaching students are uh, the part of the participating management from teaching staff, they are, they are the members of the Ohoni body and also from the Ohoni body they are selected from the committee and sales. Uh, from non-teaching staff, they are also members of the Ohoni body and they are also members of the committee and sales and uh, just in private uh, students also from committee and sales and they, are, have, they have also the ability to listen in the Ohoni body departments. Uh, the scholarship, uh, we have the scholarship at three levels, institutional level, government level, and also some students get scholarship from private uh, agencies. Uh, in institutional level, we have the, uh, some specific scholarship to the University of the Mukunda, we have the memorial scholarship, one uh, NRI, one of uh, the Indian, uh, he has provided 120,000 to the college uh, to during 2013 14. Then also our one of the information who has the yes. 55 minimum 50 marks in higher secondary to the first year students and 60% of the uh, second and third year. Then today's and economical backward. Yes, there is a trust board in the public school to provide scholarship. There is a board also. And we have our one of the that is called not any uh, money but in kind. And also we provide free seats to the students. Uh, a lot of students are getting free seats from the college. And at government level, we have different scholarships. Do you have data or data? Yes, yes, yes. 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 It is there and also I have been in my slide also. I don't need a website also, sir. Yes. Next, we have at government level, we have some of the people who have come in scholarship. We have also sponsorship of the students, female students. We have OECOSC for the students in minority section, AC is to OBC stipend, and the BD is to OBC stipend. Apart from that, uh, some students have written scholarship from GINDA, that is private agency. What is Kandashree and Kandashree? Kandashree means women, women empowerment project in Bombay to OECOM, Bombay to OECOM. That is the first uh, female students of the school, uh, they get uh, 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 700 per month. Yeah. The government, government school. Yes. Government school. Yes. And we don't provide from the college. They get uh, 7 a month, if they are not married. And during the marriage, they get 25,000 from the government. And uh, there is K, they, 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 they are divided three, but K1, K2, K3. K1 in school level, K2 in college level, K3 in university level. Uh, 
infrastructure that we have the canteen, we have library canteen activity, we have so classrooms with smart board and sound system, the public access system, we have ICT enabled and virtual classrooms, we have health checkup centers and NSS office, we have thermal scanner and disinfectant panel and sensor based sanitizers at every floor, we have water purifiers at every floor, we have fire extinguishers, we have yoga and character training center, we have separate common rooms for boys and girls. We have students in the group, we have radio rehabilitation project, we have compost kit for waste management, we have uh, solar panel also at yeah. the roof, we have trays for the working uh, staff, a powerhouse uh, with 24 hours water and power supply, medicinal or power plant garden, we have biometric attendance system, we have CCTV surveillance, and these infrastructures are provided to our, to our staff and to all the stakeholders. We have found this issue so far. Salary grant we have received uh, uh, 5 crore 83 lakh 78,350. This is the building is 5 or 16 years. Development grant is uh, from different agencies 2 crore 78,550. And donations received 7 lakh 70,650. It was just a figure before my giving to the last month. The day before yesterday, we have received 46,000 a check from the donor. Income expenditure statement, that is uh, since 2016-17, we have received the figure. Uh, you figure we have some income over expenditure and we have the recommendation for our future. So the income over expenditure is due to the fund? Yes. Yeah, yes. Our uh, is just adopted in our college. We have the grass fund for villages. We have the villages, alumni, the students, staff, the staff benefit fund for staff, Alfonso for many students, the working lunch, health checkup center for staff, students, and the family members, staff benefits for self defense, Taekwondo, female students of the college. What is the health facility you have for the students? Yeah, we have the doctors uh, in uh, every week, or three or four doctors every week. So we have the Chamber for them and the students enroll themselves for the checkup where we have a local doctor, we have a high level doctor, we have a small doctor, there are daily sources. And for emergency purposes? And for emergency purposes? Yes, in the Bangladesh, they have to go to 4 km, they have to go to 4 km. Because we have the first aid arrangement in the college also. And sir, during this pandemic session, we also organized vaccination drive for all our students. Let me also invite vaccination drive. So, we don't have any ICC committee? Yes, sir. We have a complex committee. Yes, 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 so we forwarded it to the ICC and ICC. Students or students? Students. We have also issued library books here. Sir, you can start only. Girls, yes. Why not? Why is it not only for the female students? Yes. 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 Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a casino with a letter of name of uh, Yeah, yeah. And you should introduce LCC also. Yes, and we have applied the LCC 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 I say well, I will do not to the students of this college, we also provide library to alumni and local students of other institutions. Uh, we have uh, trained the uh, villagers of the local uh, people uh, how to, to utilize the hatchery skill uh, for uh, hatchery and distribution of winter clothes to the needy people of the very uh, poor families. We have provided mobile phones to uh, students. We have uh, helped uh, to the uh, people affected by Ampan or Cyclone. We have COVID barriers to help the examining, uh, examining during the online exams at the beginning point of the COVID-19. Uh, the COVID-affected students, 
distribution mass sanitizers have determined the ability to detect to combat the spread of COVID-19. Few IFA in campus, and I help to students in the research in hostel, regular Kolkata University book have visited by students and teachers. Uh, based on innovative practices we have, we have PC payment system, online, that is online system, e-governance mode, uh, preparation of digital system. Online system means students can pay fees yes, yes, through yes. bank. Uh, online no, no, portal. Okay. Payment gateway. Payment gateway. We have two payment gateway, that is uh, one is reserve pay, another is bill list. E governance mode, prepares and presentation, presentation, annual budget, we have regularly prepared budget and place in finance subcommittee, the letter it was uh, approved by the um, government. Yes, we have a brass fund, we have also environment conservation and action committee, we have online exam portal, students can upload, students can have their questions from this portal and also they can upload their answers to the the completion of the exam. And still, faculty also can have their scripts from this portal through their login ID. Uh, ICT board of teaching learning, we have library books to local alumni to alumni local learners, we have granular harvesting project, another innovative project, empower generous number promising future. The name is given for the uh, first for introduction. So one who can register this alumni association. Yes, sir, uh, uh, in, during 2019, uh, the end of the 2019, we have tried to uh, register it. Uh, then uh, 2020, when the pandemic started, we could not proceed further. But uh, it is our uh, plan, it is a plan, so we will do it again. 